In this week's video, I show you a muscle on a knee MRI that you probably didn't know before. Hi, my name is Dr. Christoph Acton. I'm a musculoskeletal radiologist and in my YouTube channel, I teach you MSK radiology. If that's what you're looking for, so make sure you subscribe right now before watching uh, this video and also give the video a like if you think it was a good video at the end. And with that, let's jump right in. So as we all know, the more experience we get and the better we get we start to see new things this is kind of like what i refer to as increasing our internal resolution over the years and at some point in your career you will probably come across uh, something like this so kind of like a strange tubular structure here in the anterior aspect of the knee anterior or anterolateral anteromedial of the distal femur now this structure here we can also see this here very prominent one it looks like muscle it has the typical characteristic uh, or the signal of muscle uh, even on the axials so if we go up here we can see there 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 so all these tiny bits there and you start to wonder what is it like it's not vastus medialis obliquus it's not vastus lateralis it's not any of these other quadriceps muscles and this is actually the musculus articularis genu or articularis genus muscle as it's also called and it has different bundles i think that's a nice image so we can see all these different bundles coming down and in the anatomic studies i think it was about seven or so but that's variable to different sizes etc and they are originating from the distal aspect of the femur shaft so on the lateral side anterior side and medial side and they go distally and insert into the uh, suprapatellar bursa. And the idea is that this muscle, they are pulling the bursa back in order to prevent an inversion of the bursa. So let's, let's see here. So if you think about, we have the, let me just show you this here. So we've got the sac here. So technically this bursa could invert something like this, right? and cause problems. So we wanna keep the bursa up here when we flex and extend our knee. And basically that's the function of the articularis genus muscle by pulling the suprapatellar bursa cephalate or to the, towards your head or proximally so that we don't get an inversion of this and then having some form of an impingement there. So I haven't come across any pathologies of these muscles uh, as of now at least I think, and uh, but it's a good piece of anatomy to know because we don't want to confuse something like this with any kind of like a tumor and request or you know additional images or God forbid even do biopsy or something like that because it should, might look like a mass. So there's a new fact, feature on my YouTube channel and muscle, you can it's see it right here. If you like the muscle. video and if Articular you learn something, skin. instead of just giving a like, you can also now uh, click this special heart button here and by that you can sponsor or support my youtube channel directly with a tiny donation which is really great and helps me out so um yeah if you learn something consider this as like buying a coffee or something like that and then you just click there you know you will get a special message here so i just click that uh, there should be a funny animation here by tech so you can see there is a clapping animation and ultimately there is a post here that says thanks which to which i can Get the notification and can reply if you do that thank you very much and uh, let's move on now let's have a look here at this study from 2012 in an orthopedic journal they looked at this in mri and in cadavers so just here a couple of images from mri we can see these tiny bundles here on an axial image obviously that's a cadaver mri not the greatest quality but we can see it's not the quadriceps muscle it's separate muscle bundles uh, up to seven and they just dissect it down here not very interesting and we can see this here um, these different layers they even come up with three layers but that's just unnecessary information at this point we can see the articular bursa here or the suprapatellar bursa rather and how the muscle is pulling that up preventing it from falling into the joint these are just the anatomic uh, specimens here which you can uh, have a look at i will link the article in the description below this video also here nice illustration of these different bundles. 